Hi everyone, my name is Benedetto Yelpo and I am an HPV surgeon at Hospital del Mar in Barcelona, in Spain. So the purpose of this video, a senior author, is to sum up the main points of the study just published in the Journal of the American College of Surgeons. It is well known that distal coronary carcinoma is a malignancy affecting the distal part of the biliary duct, and it is associated also with poor oncological outcomes. And the start of care we know is radical pancreatotonectomy, and postoperative prognosis mainly rely on the classical TNM stage system that we know very well, which account on tumor invasion, number of positive nodes, and metastasis. However, in recent years, some further prognostic factors have been described, as the lymphonode ratio, which indicates the rate of positive nodes over total resectal nodes in the surgery. And apart from lymphonode ratio, at the NM stage, there are also some other well-known prognostic factors, and they have never been considered together. So the best tool in this case is to build a nomogram, which includes together some independent predictors and also enable a better survival prognosis calculation tailored to each patient, to each case. So for the first time, we attempt to develop a feasible nomogram for predicting survival using a large cohort from an international multicenter database, which include 415 cases from 10 different centers. And finally, we found that the lymphonode ratio at a threshold of 15, perineural invasion, differentiation grade, and radicality as independent prognostic factors. With this data, we built a nomogram that provides an accurate prognosis assessment for patients with resectal distal cholangiocarcinoma. And this may be an effective model to optimize therapeutic adjuvant treatment for these patients, for these cases. Thank you for listening and to share our work.